So, Joe, as this fighter makes his way to the octagon, let's start with the kicking technique because it is just outstanding. He doesn't telegraph a thing. And I think what really jumps out of the film room for me is his ability to get his foot off the canvas to the target so quickly. A lot of guys just don't even see it coming. And he doesn't discriminate. He'll attack that lead leg. He'll go to the body. Beautiful head kick upstairs as well. The technique is really what sets up everything to this guy's game. And his opponent certainly weary of what's coming back with those kicks tonight. This guy has toughness that you cannot teach. He has an incredible ability to absorb punishment and the mental toughness to come back from devastating situations. A jiu-jitsu black belt, but known more for his boxing acumen. The Santa Catarina Brazil-born Junior Dos Santos no UFC heavyweight has knocked down the opposition more than JDS. This man has been primed and at the top of the sport for years. He'll try to continue his assault against the elites once again here tonight, Joe. Junior Dos Santos has some of the best boxing, not just in the heavyweight division, but in all of mixed martial arts, period. He has devastating one-punch knockout power and an ever-improving ground game to go with it. for this heavyweight fight. Dos Santos is two years his senior. He is two inches taller. He will have a one inch reach advantage. To get us started with the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 62 inches tall, weighing in. 241 pounds, fighting out of Cape Town, South Africa, Big Danny. And now, his opponent, fighting out of the left hand. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 20 wins, 5 losses. He stands 64 inches tall, weighing in at 238 pounds, fighting out of Salvador Bahia, Brazil. Ladies and gentlemen, he is the former UFC heavyweight champion. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. So Herb Dean, third man in there for this one. Ready fight. Ready. And we are underway. Dos Santos gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up, Joe. He landed that punch flush. Joe, huge block there. The defense is holding up. That one hurt. Trying to establish that jab once again. He got tagged there. Oh! He's got to be careful there. Don't rush in. Well, he's got a strong jab. Miss with it there, though, Joe. How about that chin? Oh, nice. Well, he left his head open there, Joe, and he got cracked with that jab. He was almost moving into it. So let's see if he can switch up the footwork here, Joe, and make the requisite adjustments. He lands with the knee to the bottom. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Big Massive power in that shot hook. is true. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Really swung for the fences with that hook, but misses. Oh, big left hook there. Huge uppercut misses. Just over three minutes to go.
Oh, he missed that kick. And he connects there. Nice defense there. Huge block. Well, missed on that one. He caught the kick. Let's go with a left. Oh, nice straight punch there by Sagano. Yeah, he's digging into that leg kick. He's got the clinch. He's got the double. And he pummels out of it. Well, that didn't take long. Dos Santos has got the double underhooks here on the clinch now. Well, he's staying busy in the clinch here. Joe lands a nice punch there. Struggling for position in the clinch. That knee might have landed there. Back to over under. And there comes the separation now. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge blow! the punch. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Just out of range with that left hook. Oh, good job. Oh, he's, hurt. He's, hurt. he's got him hurt here. Again, going back to the jab, just out of range. Blocks the shot. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Oh! He lands the kick to the body there. Oh, he slipped well there to avoid the left hand coming back. Look at that, right to the temple. And both guys really throwing with authority. Huge kick misses. Oh! Round, round two round. coming up next. Oh, what a way to end the round. Saved by the bell. He got stunned by a huge shot right before the horn. And now, a little bit gingerly, he makes his way back to the stool. And he's only got 60 seconds to recover here. So we'll see if his corner, physically, mentally, can keep this fighter in the fight. And here's a big shot that almost ends this fight. And here's another devastating shot to the head that really does damage. Let's take a look at it from a different angle. The lovely Brittany Palmer getting the round one assignment. All right, round two. That last round was absolutely insane. Both guys got rocked. If they continue at that pace, someone's going to sleep in this round. Oh! He's hanging on here, but he is in big, big trouble. Well, Joey seems to have his opponent's timing down. He has landed some good shots, but nothing really in terms of multi-shot combinations, and perhaps that's why his opponent's still standing. So perhaps at this point, he could change up the power with which he throws some of these strikes, maybe alter the tempo a little bit, and try to make it so it's not just one and done when it comes to his striking attack. Nice front kick to the body. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Oh! Can he hang on? Oh! That's it. He's out. He's out. Excellent timing here to land a big left hand to stop the fight. 
Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. And here's the end of the fight. Here it is from another angle. Here we see it again. Boom! And that's all she wrote. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the huge knockout victory. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. The official decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, the referee Herb Dean's going to stop in this contest at 54 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Junior Sagrada Dos Santos. So congratulations to Sagano Junior Dos Santos on yet another big win here tonight. Maybe his son Bento's even old enough now to be watching his dad go to work, and if so, what an inspiring effort he saw in this one. Junior Dos Santos lighting up this arena with his performance tonight.